All right, now I'm cleaning cages like I always do, <laughs> you know, all the time. And stick with me, guys, because I'll explain to you what I'm going to show you in this video. Um, this is uh, Nerv this is uh, Phoenix. She's a call strain albino. She's been breeding uh, with the male hypo 100% hit for Sterling. Now she is in shed. Um, he's still trying to lock up with her. He's still locking up with her. And this is what you like to see when you're breeding. You see this right here. Sorry, my hand. Um, I got my latex gloves on because I'm cleaning. Um, this is what you call sperm. And see how there's two? I just knocked one piece off. And let me get the other piece off. That's dried up sperm. So he's still continuing to try to breed her. When you're breeding boas and stuff like that and other snakes, that's a good sign. That's what you want to see. He's producing sperm. He's I know he's been locking up with her. But that right there is what you want to see. So he is a horny boy. He's doing his job. And you got to love that. You got to love when you see stuff like that. And even though she's in shed, she's still allowing him to, to do her thing. Um, she should shed out. Um, her eyes are starting to clear up. Um, she still looks a little bit milky. Not too bad. Let me see underneath you, girl. Yeah, see, the underneath is starting to get less pink. Um, I don't know if I'll show you that or not, but um, definitely starting to get less pink. So, she should be shedding out, I would say, probably in the next three days. And he'll just keep going at her, and we'll keep them together. We'll keep breeding them. But this is what you love to see as a breeder. This is what it's about. You know, and as you notice, um, I use newspaper, which I know, you know, you got to know... know the danger to use a newspaper, look it up. You can find it. You can't you don't want it wet. If it's wet, you gotta clean it. I'm cleaning this because I just cleaned this cage this morning. Um and then I went and did some running and I came home to Priest, you wanna come down here? This. And look, you can see how it's still gooky and stuff. So literally they did that while I was out running. <laughs> so this has gotta get clean. We'll put a new bowl in here, we'll disinfect this bowl. And we'll get this cage clean. You can't leave anything in your cages like this. If you see this, you have to clean it. Now, I understand when you first put them together, they'll go to the bathroom. You want to leave that in there. But once they start establishing and they're breeding, you can't leave this in there. And even if you're breeding and you see this on the water bowl, you got to replace the water bowl right away. Um, but that's just, that's just urine. That's all it is. No poop, just urine. But it has to be cleaned up right away. I can't. The only reason why I'm doing this video, why I'm doing this, because I'm in the process of cleaning, is I want to show you the sperm on the female, because I thought that was pretty cool. But I'm going to get back to cleaning, ain't that right, buddy? Yep. You're my big help, aren't you? Yeah. You do all the disinfectant, and I do the cages. So he's he's a huge help. So I'm going to get back to cleaning. Hopefully you guys have a blessed and positive day. I know I am. Still getting caught up on videos. I'll get there. I know I'll, I'm a little late to respond to some, but I will get there. Um, but yeah, make sure you clean and you can see she's a, a just a beautiful call strain albino big girl and doing her thing. So, all right. So you guys have a blessed positive. This is Boxing Bob Priest saying peace.